All right, there's big breaking news coming at this point of time. Uh, there is, uh, of course, information coming in. The Kaveri Water Management Authority has ordered the Karnataka government should release 5,000 cusecs of water to Tamil Nadu for the next 15 days. Let's go across to Deepak Bupana, who is joining us for more on this. Deepak, we have seen protests take place in uh, Karnataka, particularly in the Old Mysore region. And now, with this decision coming of the Kaveri Water Management Authority, what likely is going to be the reaction from the government and, of course, from the protesting farmers. Well, uh, the government has made it amply clear that they, they are not in a position to release water. They were hoping that there will be some sort of relief Madhav, coming from the CW, CWMA, which hasn't. The CD, uh, CWMA in its order is saying that, yes, there is a, a situation, there is a drought situation in Karnataka. Tamil Nadu demanded 12,500 cusecs, but the order of the CWRC has to be uh, maintained. That is only for 5,000 cusecs of water. So how the CWMA or the CWRC is looking at it is that they are not giving into the demands of Tamil Nadu. Much lesser quantity of water is being asked to release. But here in Karnataka, even for 5,000 cusecs of water, the government is maintaining. If they do it now, by the end of April next year, you know, which the reservoirs that right now contain water will have to be supplying water to uh, even Bengaluru for drinking water needs, and it's nearly impossible is what they maintain. The only recourse right now left, of course, is the Supreme Court. We'll really have to see whether uh, the top court will intervene because last time around they had said that they are not an expert in this matter. It is the authority or the regulatory authority uh, that will, in fact, look into it. So whether there will be any sort of relief and how this decision of the CWMA will reflect on the ground, especially around the Kaveri Basin, which has seen multiple protests, is something that remains to be seen, Madhav. Well, absolutely. And in fact, let's take this across to my colleague Kitty as well, who's uh, with the order. Kitty, take us through this particular order. Yes, Madhav, these are the details of the meeting and the order copy that we've accessed uh, of the uh, emergency meeting that was held today of the CWMA, that is the Kaveri Water Management Authority. Uh, after Karnataka government had said that it's not in a position to release any more water to Tamil Nadu. What it says is that, uh, the order copy says is that taking note of the severity of the drought in the Kaveri Basin of Karnataka, which has been increasing and enlarging putting at a greater risk even the drinking water needs and minimum needs of irrigation, Karnataka has made submissions that it's not in a position to release the water unless the inflows into the reservoirs improves. Now, in turn, Tamil Nadu has urged for releasing total 12,500 cusecs of water, which is inclusive of a backlog of 6,500 cusecs for next 15 days. Finally, the CWMA, duly upholding the recommendations of CWRC, has ordered that Karnataka Karnataka has to ensure 5,000 cusecs realization at uh, Billy Gunlu for the next 15 days as indicated by the CWRC. Now the next meeting also has been scheduled for 26th of uh, September 2023. Madhav. Thanks so much for that quick update there, uh, Kitty. Very, very important indeed. And in fact, uh, what is uh, very important, of course, is that we are uh, reporting from Parliament. And in fact, we bring all these news updates to you as well. But uh, our focus now shifts to the Parliament, where, in fact, the special session is currently underway. What really could be on the agenda is what we're looking at.